What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Wes, human crack in the flesh, and this is Kicks from Wes. Welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time watching, go ahead and hit the subscribe button, tap the bell notification so you'll be notified when I post videos. And if you really want to help the channel out, leave a like. I would appreciate it and comment down in the comment section. So I'm back with another video, man. I got a phone call about some shoes. I was on the hunt for looking for these things for a while now. So I'm here at Ontario Mills, which is behind me. So we're going to go inside, pick up these shoes, and I'll show you guys what I get when we get back to the studio. So stay tuned. So we finally made it inside, had to take little man to the bathroom, so we decided to do that. And there is a Nike outlet inside Ontario Mills. So before I head to the store that I need to go to because it's just close by to it, I'm going to head over to the Nike outlet, which is right over there behind that sign. Alright, so I was scouring through the aisles and look what I find already. These Nike, I mean, these Jordan 1 Coutures, man, already in the outlet. I'm not surprised at all. This is a size 12. So, this is one shoe that's up here right now in Ontario's Mills. Um, I'm going to come back to you guys a little bit later and see what else I find. Because I'm trying to be in and out, man. But yeah, here we go. Air Jordan 1 uh, Couture, man. Already in the Nike outlet. Crazy. Dang, boy, this is crazy. Size 11. Got the pony hair sixes up this joint. And I was thinking about copping these two, yo. For real, I was thinking about copping these. My question is, how do they know if the shoe is real or not? That's my question. But yeah, look at this. Already at the outlet. Already here. Had to secure that bag. Now I got a whole hour to drive back home, man. But it is what it is. Came out here to get what I needed to get. Stay tuned. I'm about to hop back in the whip. I got to feed these kids first. And then I'll show you guys exactly what I got. We're back in the studio. And, hey, it was a long ride home, man. That hour turned into almost two hours just to get back home. This is why I live in the desert. And I don't live close to L.A. like that. Because if you don't leave... Around the time that you really need to leave by, you're going to be sitting in some traffic. But I ain't going to stall y'all no longer. <clears throat> Bag was secured from chips. Got the Nike box right here. And I went a half size up on this pair right here. I went on and got me a size 11. These retail at $180 and that's what I paid um I didn't want to pay that resale value I don't know what the resale value was but I just figured why not take a little ride since I ain't been to Ontario Mills in a while and I got that phone call saying that these was there and so I went on ahead took that drive and went ahead and got them so <clears throat> oh and the person that held them for me even left their initials in the box. But I ain't going to show you that because I don't need you going, trying to contact. Like, hey, I see you be holding shoes for Wes. What's up? I know Wes. Nah, you good. Relax. <laughs> <clears throat> so, let me set this right there. Pull one of these bad boys out. Oh, man, these shits look sweet for real. Wait till y'all see this shoe here. But, hey. I've seen a lot of people on YouTube doing a review on this shoe, but not this model, man. Everybody that I've seen that did a review say that they like this shoe. And when I first seen pictures of this shoe, I was like, yo, that shit look dope. And I got to get me a pair of these. So without further ado, man, what did I cop? Bow! The Nike Air Max 97 Wild West. Now, like I just stated, a lot of people on YouTube did reviews on the 98s. The 98s is cool, in my opinion, 
I'm not a 98 guy, you know what I mean? Just for, I just don't really like 98s like that. I don't have no pair of 98s. And this is my first 97 to be exact, you know what I mean? My first pair of 97s. But when I see it, it just looks doper to me on a 97 than a 98. That's just how I feel, man. But check this shoe out here. Let me get close up on it so you guys can see that, that look right there. Come on, camera focus. There we go. You got your red Nike check. <clears throat> you know, right there. Bang, bang. You got your, your red stripe of the red bandana print. Going all the way around to the toe box area. Got that brown looking. Uh, it ain't really kind of suede. It did something on here, but it ain't suede. It feels it feel suede, I ain't gonna lie. It feels suede, but ain't no back and forth with this joint here. You feel me? Then you got your, your denim print all on the upper part of this shoe. Going up to your lace area. Another Nike check here on your pull tab. And I'm going to try to get you guys that 3M effect. Because it is 3M uh, here. Along this here. And I think the laces or something like that else. Is 3M as well. But yeah man. Check the soles out. Nice little red. Going with the brown. Blue bubble with the Nike check right there. <clears throat> excuse me, guys. Excuse me. And yeah, man. Very dope shoe. Very dope shoe. For real. Like these a lot. Just something about them. When I seen them, I said, man, I got to grab those. Got to grab them. Let me know in the comment sections what kind of fit would you put together to go with these. Or could you, uh, could you put a fit together to even go with these? Like, do you even like these shoes? I like these, so this is why I grabbed them. There you go. Check out that booty. Looking good. Uh, something going off on my phone. Probably telling me some news. Some some shoes probably just dropped. A restock. You know how I go in the game. But yeah, I'm going to pull the phone out to give you guys that, uh, <clears throat> that 3M look. Oh, that's news they talking about. Robert Kraft. <laughs> they gonna get you, Mr. Kraft. Hanging out with the Dream Chasers. Meek Millie. <laughs> Man, they didn't, they didn't update the damn phone. So some of the settings on the phone. Alright, so here we go. Can you see it? Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna pause the video real quick. I need to turn this light off. Camera, let's see. Well, I tried to do the, the 3M effect, but it ain't working. It ain't working. So, there you have it with these right here, man. Let me know how you feel about this shoe. I like this shoe a lot. That's why I went ahead and brought it, you know. Glad to add these to the collections. Um, another pair of shoes I might be grabbing, uh, it might be to, to have a have a Nike, very Nike day or something like that. I don't know. My brain is all over the place, man. But yeah, it's crazy. You know what I mean? Seeing those uh, cow fur pony hair sixes in there. 
the Couture ones already in the outlet. That was crazy to see that, but I ain't surprised because, you know, a lot of people wasn't rocking with them. So, it is what it is, man. It is what it is. But stick around. The On Foot is up next. I ain't want to take too much time on your day. I thank you guys for watching. You know what I mean? Shout out to all the new subscribers who subscribe to the channel, man. Thank you guys so much. Until the next video, it's your boy Wes. This is Kicks from Wes. Stay blessed. Stay fresh. I'm out. Peace.